Dude, that's so cool, bro. I'm so stoked. You remember this home? It's near Buffalo and Sahara, and the guy who lives here turns his 6,000 square foot mansion into art. He's doing it again for Halloween, but there's a twist, and he wants you to be involved. Because, like, you really got to be, like, a big YouTuber to have this feature, like... Today, Fox 5 went over to the graffiti mansion to see what it's what's inspired it all. You may remember this. It racked up more than 60 million views online. This colorful masterpiece is Armani Azadi's home. When the, when the tragedy happened, I didn't know what to do. And I, and I just felt lost. I wanted to do something positive and I was staring at my house and I was like, has anyone just painted an entire mansion before? After the response he got online, Armani painted his house two more times, a Christmas theme, a Fortnite theme, and now his house is transforming for the fourth time. <laughs> mansion. Once again, Armani is spray painting his 6,000 square foot mansion, this time for Halloween, and having racked up hundreds of millions of views. Going for our fourth viral project here, hopefully. He's hoping this time he can turn those views into something good for the community. So today is about the Boys and Girls Club benefiting the Boys and Girls Club. Tuesday, he had dozens of kids over to see the beginning of the house and to carve pumpkins. We dumped 40 tons of mulch in the front driveway to make a giant pumpkin patch. Armani is partnering with the Boys and Girls Club and accepting donations all month long. This feels like gut. Yeah, we, we've actually never had um, people that we don't know over to a graffiti mansion project. So this is our first time opening the gates. As kids and parents carved pumpkins and got their hair done. Do this for free? I mean, that's my hats off to them. Dozens of artists continue to work on the mansion. We have people from South Africa here, Ireland here, yep. and tons of Vegas strong locals. Yes. Yeah. Some even stopped to help kids spray paint their pumpkins. Yeah, it's so great to note that like everybody that came from all over the world are volunteers. So this is a volunteer art project. And his gates aren't just open to the Boys and Girls Club. Armani and his team want you to stop by to see the house for yourself. Amazing. Never seen nothing like it. But just remember why they're doing it. We're also accepting pumpkins, candy, anything sealed here at the mansion all month long. And Armani says he chose to help the Boys and Girls Club because that's where it all started for him. For me, I went to the Boys and Girls Club when I was younger and I got inspired and it turned into all this that you see now. And for the Boys and Girls Club, he's doing a good thing. Armani says his home will be done in time for Halloween, but he will be accepting money, sealed candy, pumpkins, and carving kits all month long. He says come November 1st, his house will be painted back white. Oh, bro, thank you so much, Max. Go. It's like a tree, like the ladder can't move. I need to talk to Armani for a second.
pop the bazooka up too much, build that pressure inside the tube and spew out the top. Yep. That was my bad. Yeah, so you hide the wall, roll it along, keep the wheel in contact with the wall the whole time, otherwise you'll get air. Stop, cut, roll forward and advance. And that brings the tape out to your next one. Cut, roll forward and advance. Stop, cut, and forward, advance. Side. How are you going to do that? Flip it over and work left handed. Alright folks, time to do some ceilings right here. We've got the man Gary. Nine pumps. Nine pumps, not ten. Not ten. So you like having an extra flexible blade? Yeah, that's good. Blades are down nice. Yeah. Could I just take a bit of head on that? It's like a uh, head that rotates. Yeah, it's made by um, Easy Bead. It's known for operating plug. 
Easy B. I remember when I first uh, started using the flat box and when I um, could do everything from the ground, I was like, oh my god, this is awesome. You did it. The more you can do off the floor, the easier it is on the body. Yeah. So much faster too. Like. Oh yeah, I'm the front here, yeah. <laughs> it looks like I did some work. Thank you. 